Hey, welcome back to Rob's Garage Woodworking. Today, I just want to talk about this gazebo that we have up on top of our deck. Now, because it's up here, it's prone to be being caught by the wind. So what I have to do is anchor it so it doesn't go anywhere. Because it's on the deck, I can't anchor it into the ground with the tie straps that it came with, but I can anchor it to the deck. So I'm gonna show you how I did that. All right, so for this project, I'm going to use this nylon coated galvanized strapping that looks like this. This is really handy. I use some self-tapping bolts. These are like this, hex head eight by one and a half, number eight by one and a half, and some deck screws, okay? I'm gonna use my smallest drill bit and just a driver for the hex head screw, okay? So what happens is the legs come out and they they move around, the whole thing can move. So you know, mount the leg in there. All right, so I have to keep the screen out of the way. So we'll have to move this around here and let's try to put this in so it will go from here and we'll get it about there just use a pair of wire cutters side cutters okay you cut one part at a time just cut through the hole like this Line these two up, put the screw in, put the screw through the two holes, and screw it in. Okay, make sure nothing's pinched. Line this up, pre drilled the hole. Use the self tapping hardware. Okay. Put that in. And once it's tight, just leave it. So there you go. That's strapped in. That'll help to prevent it from being lifted and moved. Alright, so it comes with these plastic feet. So I'm going to drill a hole through that. And I'm going to attach one of these straps here. So I will strap this down to the ground, okay? So first, I'm gonna cut the strap to size, screw this in to the deck. Okay, make sure that's down all the way. Just a touch more. Now, I'm gonna drill a hole through here and put my screw in. Soft tapping screw in. Oh, that's a pain. Come on, buddy. There. That'll keep it locked in to the ground so it can't lift up. All right, so I've locked each one of these in. So down at the bottom, each one has a strap going from the leg to the deck. And that's bolted in, bolted to the deck. So each leg has one of these. And then up at the top, this one is right by the overhang of the rear door. So that's bolted in the soffit there. Okay, bolt it into the leg so that doesn't go anywhere. This one's bolted in here. It's bolted into the rail so that won't go anywhere. It's also bolted into the ground. And then the back one here is bolted around here and here. The back deck rail as well. And to the floor. So this is kind of the final thing. I've bolted 
the two first legs to the back before that worked well and then I bolted the other legs to the sides that worked well and now I'm just bolting them to the ground to keep the front legs from lifting the back legs were good it's just these front legs that were lifting in the wind so hopefully that should keep everything down from now anyway thanks for watching